guys, I'm a little late, but better late than never, right? An unshakably happy God. These things I have spoken to you that my joy may be in you and that your joy may be full. John 15, 11. God is absolutely sovereign. Our God is in the heavens. He does all that he pleases. Psalms 115, 3. Therefore, he is not frustrated. He rejoices in all his works when he contemplates them as colors of the magnificent mosaic of redemptive history. He is unshakably happy God. His happiness is foundationally the delight he has in himself. Before creation, he rejoiced in the image of his glory in the person of his son, his beloved son in whom he was well pleased. Then the joy of God went public in the works of creation and redemption. These works delight the heart of God because they reflect his glory. The heavens are telling the glory of God. May the glory of the Lord endure forever. May the Lord rejoice in his works. He does everything he does to preserve and display that glory, for in this his soul rejoices. All the works of God culminate in the praises of his redeemed people. Praise him for his mighty deeds. Praise him according to his excellent greatness. The climax of his happiness is the delight he takes in the echoes of his excellence in the praises of the saints. His delight is not in the strength of the horse, nor is pleasure in the legs of a man, but the Lord takes pleasure in those who fear him, in those who hope in his steadfast love. But our praise is not only God's delight as an echo of his excellence, it is also the apex of our joy. Praise is the consummation of the joy we have in seeing and savoring the greatness of God. Therefore, God's pursuit of praise from us and our pursuit of pleasure in him are the same pursuit. This is the great outcome of the gospel of the glory of the grace of God in Christ. All right, guys, I love you. Father God, I lift up all my friends who are watching, Father God, and maybe someone who's new. Lord, I ask that you would touch their heart. Let them feel the love that you have for them. Give everyone a repentant heart, God. Keep us every day starting anew with you so that we don't fall back. Thank you, Jesus. You are a wonderful God and your mercies are new every day. Thank you that we can go to bed at night and you are there. When we sleep, you are there. And we wake up, you are there. And when we go about our day, you are there. Thank you, Jesus. Bless everyone who's listening. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, guys. I love you. Have a wonderful weekend. God bless.